Hello, what's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, of course, this time last week I did ask you to write down your questions or type your questions in the comments below. Of course, many of you don't even know me just yet, so there was less questions than I expected, but um, I'm going to get through them and yeah, um, I'll tell you more about what's going to be coming up in the videos um, very soon. I'm actually currently um, working on my um, skills. <laughs> to um, do my very first edited video for my music um, to hopefully share to you and share to the world here on YouTube uh, as soon as possible so I can promise you that. So um, today we're going to be basically asking you a few questions and it's going to feel very good so I am really looking forward to it. If you are to find out a little bit more about me and what I'm going to be doing for the video please smash that like button if you have not, subscribe to my channel and um, yeah I think we shall get started with all the, those questions that you asked me. Of course, this isn't an edited video, so um, I just want to say that um, I will do more editing videos at the moment, so I'm kind of, in a, in a way I'm live, but I'm not exactly live. Um, now, a few people uh, kind of misled what I was asking for them, and they were like, favourite this and favourite that, some of these questions are. But there are some questions that people uh, commented um, on that they want to see based on what I'm going to be doing for the channel and I'll, I'll explain more about that at, towards the end of this Q&A session. Of course this is the first one and hopefully um, if you get to know me in that, hopefully later on once I've got a few videos under my belt we'll be able to get started with um, another Q&A session um, that I can go through with you guys. Okay so um, coming up uh, we have all these favourite questions that are coming up so um, my favourite such and such. Um, so, without further ado, let us get started. So, um, it is a bit um, live, so I uh, hope you'll get through. Um, please also comment if this is a good position, because it is quite a mild day with me recording this. This is quite a mild day, it's raining, um, but I thought I've got nothing else to do, so we'll just get on with it. Um, but hopefully it will be fine. If you want it to be lighter or such and such, then do comment down below. Um, and comment down below if you did enjoy this video and any other any other videos you want me to do that isn't music and that. Without further ado, let's get started with our first couple of questions. Now, I'm just going to go straight in with some of the favourite questions. So, um, hopefully, um, we'll see if... Um, and then we'll get on to some more after. So, first of all, um, I'm just going to go down the list rather than put them in order. And I'm going to start off with my dream car. Now, uh, someone asked me what my dream car is. Um, I'm not driving as of yet. This year, I've got a little bucket list for the first time, um, which might sound a bit weird because usually you set a bucket list for the future before you before you die. And uh, I've got a bucket list for this year because I want to get through a few things this year. Um, one is, of course, getting a job. Um, and the other one is learning to drive and such and such. My dream car. Um, I used to like cars when I was a kid, when I was younger. Um, I'm now 20, by the way. Um, but there are... Yeah, there are a few that um, I kind of like. I mean, recently, of course, there's been smart cars. So, uh, like, for instance, Fords, which my uncle had. And um, I wish he kept it anyway because, of course, he's changed cars now. But I wish he kept it. So and then maybe I could have had it um, when uh, he had it, if I did pass my driving test. And, of course, I've... Um, basically, I um, hope that I could get something like that. Something that's um, a bit entertaining and, um, you know, it has, like, the screen... Part. so I can just type, I can just put, say I have sat nav and it's quite, kind of like a smart car. Um, another thing which a YouTuber has, um, it's a Tesla, uh, which is quite smart and um, it does all sorts of things, it can dance for you, it can do all sorts of things. Um, the YouTuber's name is Adam B and I'll leave a comment, uh, I'll leave a, a link down below in my um, description so that you can um, have a look at his video because he's quite cool and um, I like his uh, prank videos and he does a lot of stuff and uh, you may even notice that he's on Blue Peter, he's the 40th percent of Blue Peter so I'm super happy with him with that. But yeah, um, I would say a dream car would be a Ford maybe or um, I mean a lot of people would say dream car's a Lamborghini but <laughs> I don't think I'd be able to call uh, a Ford so I don't think I'd be able to afford that. So um, yeah, I think dream car would be a Ford one, any, any smart car, any car would do, any car would do, uh, any kind of car, red car, green car, black car, blue car, any car would do. And same with the make as well, I don't really mind any car as long as it can do the job of getting me from A to B, that'll be absolutely fine. 
So yeah, my next is my dream job. Uh, someone asked me what my dream job is, and um, I'm at the moment looking for a job. I ha went for an interview. Uh, I had a virtual interview, of course. I went for an interview a couple of a week, a couple of weeks ago, um, at a place which is kind of like um, for old people, old people's homes. But um, I'm kind of like the office administrator. Um, I'm currently doing a course on teaching as well. That's kind of the side as well. So, but at the moment, I'm looking for a job just because cause schools schools are shut because we're in a if you're watching this, we're in another national lockdown, the second national lockdown, um, here in 2021. So what a great start to the year. Yes. <laughs> but, um, yeah, a dream job would be, um, a proper dream job. I always thought what it would be like to at least, and I think on my bucket list for the year, would be to uh, be a part of a um, short film or just like a series of, um, my one of the dream jobs which is never going to happen is um, being part of EastEnders, one of my favourite soaps. So, uh, that'd be a really good thing to be a part of, um, and at least to be some be somewhere else rather than Bedford um, would be absolutely incredible. So um, yeah, my dream job would would be a presenter or an actor or all sorts of those things. But if I can't do that, then my proper job here would be uh, working if an office admin or a teaching assistant, and maybe even head teacher. Because I, I promise you that if I run your school, I would make sure it's uh, really good. So don't worry about that. So uh, that is something that I really would love to do. So, that is of course my dream job. Uh, my favourite food. Someone's asked me my favourite food. Now, I've got a range. I like everything. Apart from, I mean, I'm always eating uh, jack potatoes, really, because of course my parents are on a diet. So, um, I'm kind of eating sometimes what they eat. Um, and I just eat a lot of rubbish. So, um, I'm surprised that I'm not even, I'm not even fat. And yet, I'm eating out of the house, I'm eating out of the house, especially during this pandemic, it's terrible. So, <laughs> um, I really haven't really got favourite food. I used to like, like, my favourite food back in the day was meatballs, or I still like them, and I still like popcorn chicken. Um, but I like any any food, so any food you'd give me, I'd, I'd eat. That isn't jack potatoes, which does get a bit boring when you eat them. But apart from that, I absolutely uh, love food. <laughs> Who doesn't? Who doesn't? Who doesn't? I'm sure you can comment if you like food or not. Um, who doesn't? Now, someone's asked me, which um, I'm never, I've never been a fan of it. Your favourite boxer. I've never been a fan of boxing. Um, I would say because I kind of like him as an actor, my favourite boxer would be, oh, past and present, past, uh, would be John Cena, because I like him as a bit of acting and he's such a funny guy as well. Um, and I've seen little clips of, um, wee clips of him boxing back in the day and uh, he is quite cool and he's a very good role model to those and yeah um i do like him i'm just gonna be swift on there because i can say that one thing that you've got to know about me is that music is my strongest subject but sport is not <laughs> sport i never i used to be last picked for any team at sport and i used to also just i just didn't like sport in general so uh if you ask me to play football i'll probably like i'll probably watch or referee i won't play football because i'm absolutely terrible i'm awful so don't ask me <laughs> um yeah but yeah, my favourite drink, um, I like, for instance, I like Fanta, I like um, Coke, Pepsi, uh, Dr Pepper, Red Bull. Um, yeah, I still haven't got wings in and I drink a lot of Red Bull. Um, but alcohol drink, if it was the case, if you asked me for that, is um, I like Strongbow or Coppenberg. Some of you who, of course, can do drink or maybe have heard these drinks may know what they are. But they're kind of like ciders, they're kind of fruity, you don't get drunk straight away. You, you have like about four of them and you can get drunk after that. So you don't get drunk straight away. And it's quite it's fruity. It's like there isn't many alco much alcohol in it. It's quite fruity, but still you can get drunk without even... Without even know, well, you'd know it because you'd stand up and you'd feel a bit dizzy. So that'd be something that would be very just awful. I absolutely wouldn't... Um, I don't really like getting drunk. And funny enough, I've been drunk many times in the past since I was 18. And I've never had a hang... Like, hangover i've never really had a proper like i've never been drunk where i've, I've fell asleep and then i'm waking up and i'm very uh hang hung over as it were um uh, where i'm dizzy and i get headaches and whatnot so that's quite good for me that's uh, something that i wouldn't do um yeah so uh, moving on and my next question that i'm going to answer is from another person and it who else would it be? I'm not going to make them up, am I? <laughs> um, is 
kind of relating to um, music, um, and it's basically what's your favourite genre. Someone's asking me, just asking me what's my favourite genre. Now my favourite genre, it's kind of a vast range. I, if there's something on, I might listen to it, I might like it. Um, there's, I'm going to start with probably, not the worst one, but the least likely I'd listen to, and that is rap. Uh, like, I know you like Post Malone, I do like Stormzy, um, and maybe a few more. Eminem I used to like, I love Slim Shady, if you remember, back in the day, you'd listen to Slim Shady and that would be amazing. And I really do like um, Eminem as well. But yeah, um, apart from that, I don't really listen to rap. But I do listen to um, pop, uh, rock. Um, I will give you a list of, I might give you a list of uh, artists that I listen to. And if you like them, again, smash the like button. Please smash the like button. I'd really appreciate it. I really would. Um, if you do like, I'll do music as well. And I'll do pranks as well. And you'll see, you, you'll you like it. I can assure you that I'll I'll try and keep you entertained through this pandemic. Um, but yeah, uh, music is one taste. And I do like a bit of pop. I do like rock and indie. Um, and yeah, other parts is that I've got a family who I've been to a lot of parties, of course, I haven't been now because of course we're in, in the middle of a pandemic. But I've been to many parties and um, mainly play Irish <laughs> because some of my family from Ireland and my granddad got rest him, he was from Ireland as well and um, we've got a lot of people from Ireland as well who are part of the family as well so um, yeah we do listen to a bit of Irish music, the Irish Rover and um, yeah so we've got kind of an Irish background as well so um, for the family so uh, I do a bit of Irish and other party classics, other old classics as well, I don't mind as well. Um, if there's a question about it, if I'm in a quiz for music, then I might get some of it right because I've been in with the family who's taken me all the way back to Elvis Presley. So <laughs> that's um, quite good. But yeah, so that is my favourite music. And uh, I'm actually going to give you a list now of my favourite rock bands and pop bands, and, which is actually what someone actually asked me. Someone asked me what are my favourite what. Um, give me a list of your favourite rock bands or pop bands or whatever. So I'll give you a list. So I do like start with pop. Uh, I do like any pop really. Uh, Ollie Murs is kind of like someone I could relate to in that. Um, I do like the bands take that steps. Um, my mum would like that. My mum's got me into them. So oops, Westlife, um, Boyzone. I mean Boyzone is split up anyway. Um, but I like all sorts of pop rock bands. I like Fall Out Boy, Panic at the Disco, Twenty One Pilots, Coldplay. Nothing but Thieves, some of these are indie, his mate. Well, it's a Coldplay, Nothing but Thieves, um, Walk the Moon, um, uh, what else? Uh, I've got so much favourite bands that I'm literally forgotten. <laughs> I've literally forgotten what my favourite bands are. Um, but Bastille, um, and it's a Bastille, just to clarify that. Um, and uh, they'll probably come up to me and you'll see them up there. Probably my most recent one that I've kind of gotten into is Youngblood. Um, and I actually forgot my favourite band anyway, Churches, which are a synth band, and also Paris with a V, and um, Pale Waves from Manchester, they kind of started out with the first album there, hopefully having their second album released this year. Um, but yeah, I've got all sorts, um, and if you do like them, like I said, smash that button, and you won't be disappointed because I will try and keep you entertained through these dark times, um, and there will be a lot of stuff going on. Um, I'm kind of going over time with what I was hoping I was hoping in the last about 10 minutes, but I've lasted over over 10 minutes, uh, nearly 15 minutes now. But um, what I'm going to quickly do is quickly, um, one more question, um, which is what is, which is going to end with, what is my favourite, uh, what I'm going to be doing for YouTube? So for YouTube, uh, I'm going to be doing music reviews. I'm going to be doing um, old ones as well as new ones. I'll be keeping you updated on some of the new ones and what I think about those new albums, as well as giving you some throwback. I might do a throwback Thursday choose, uh, channel where every Thursday I'll release a throwback album. So way back. So I would class myself because of course I've been just started. I'll class it like two, three years, three years on. So from 2017, 2018 to now, um, I will class them as new albums. But for backwards from 2016 all the way down to even the 90s or something like that then I will um do like I'll do it on my own throwback playlist I'll put it on the throwback playlist throwback channel um which will uh, basically go through so it might go for instance if you know Coldplay's first album um I believe it's called Parachutes um it was released in 2002 that will be on part of the throwback because it is a it was released like 18 years ago so I was only two then so um who was released then, and I'll give you an update. And I'll even do other things I'll do as top tens, 
um, maybe top 20, or the top of an artist. Or I might even do the top of my favourite songs from that album. So, for instance, for Coldplay's Power Shoes, I might decide that Yellow, which is from the album, will be number one. And then I might put a song at number two, something number three, all the way up to the last song, um, which is... And I'll do the maximum. So, say, like, there's 13 songs on an album, I'll do my top 13 of those songs from that album. I'll do that as well. So that'll be hopefully keeping you entertained, I'll hopefully do my job and keep you entertained, and your job is to be entertained. So, um, so um, what we'll do is that I'm going to wrap up now. Thank you so much. Um, if you are tuned in, if you are watching, um, thank you so much for watching. Please again, smash the like button. I'll leave everything in the description below that I mentioned, like Adam's, Adam B's channel. Um, I'll, I'll put it in the description, I'll put his link in the description below. And please do uh, join me for another video. Like I said, I'm doing. I'm already in the middle of doing my very first um, music video. So, um, yeah, so do keep an eye out for that. That'll be released in the next week or so. I'm still getting the ropes around, I think. But that is it. That has been me. Thanks so much. And I will see you for another video. Don't forget to smash the like button. Subscribe to my channel. Put on the post notification bell as well so that you don't miss a single video. And see you later. Peace out wrong way this thing i'm using my phone at the moment as well so i do apologize about that but in the meantime thanks so much for watching see you later